Good morning, good morning, good morning, you lovely lot. Sorry about the terrible lighting because I'm against the window, which is very poor form. Um, it is Tuesday. I've been to work and dropped the kids off at school. Um, and I am now working on putting a chili con carne in the slow cooker before taking the cat to the vets for her last vaccination. So I'm just browning off the meat and the onion a little bit and then I can leave that cooking um, yeah I can leave all of this cooking while I'm at work and then when Kenzie gets in from work he's got some bits and bobs to eat well, you know he's got something to eat you could just heat up a rice we've got various packets of rice this lighting is terrible I'm so sorry I'm struggling to find somewhere to set the camera up but I'm in a bit of a rush um, so yeah, I just want to get this on the go. Kenzie's got exams this week because he's doing his retakes. So he gets the opportunity to retake his maths and his English. Um, now, and then if he doesn't pass them again, then he has the opportunity to take them in July when everyone else does their GCSEs. If he passes, then he doesn't have to go to the English lessons. Ooh. English lessons anymore um, he says he felt like he did really really well yesterday actually um, he told me some of the things he wrote in his English um, he had to describe a town or he had to write a story about an unlikely friend friendship to do with um, a fisherman I think it was um, and he said he told me some of the sentences that he had written and the descriptions of he decided to go with des describing the town and he told me about some of the descriptions that he'd used. Um, it sounds like a lovely story. I'm so sorry. I've moved you because that was terrible. It went really pitch black. Um, yes, so now you've just got this huge light behind me. <sighs> and I got caught in the rain, so I've got curtains. Um, yes. So I was very pleased with what, what he had written from, you know, the few bits he told me. So fingers crossed he will... Um, yeah, you know, he'll do well this time. He was only just off of it last time, to be fair. So, um, right, so yes, we don't do chili con carne with kidney beans because Lee doesn't like kidney beans. So, we use baked beans and we use no added sugar because Lee's diabetic. Um, Going to use some tomatoes, whoops, which obviously are full of sugar, but it's part of a meal, so you know. I have some sugar, right. okay, and then I need to mix this with some water. What am I doing for time? And then I've got to go and catch Cat, who's going to be most unhappy about going to the vets again. How much water do I need in this? 250. That. Is that about that? So yeah, the cat was very happy to see me after my weekend away. But she probably won't be happy to see me tonight after I've, you know, taken her to the vets and then released her. She'll probably avoid me again, which is what she does, because I'm the mean person that does all the mean things. Now it's time to catch a cat in her usual spot. She's not going to be happy with me. I caught her while she was sleeping. She didn't have a chance to think about what was happening. She's still half asleep. So let's get in the van and get to the vets. Here you go. Oh, I'm such a meanie. Right, I'm going to put your vaccination card in the basket so I know where it is next time. I'm back at work. I have got myself a cup of tea, put the battery on charge, put the charged up battery on there. I've put a load of washing on. I'm about to fold this laundry and put it upstairs. I'm going to put some bleach in the toilets and then I'm going to work myself from the top down. 
um, top of the house down to the bottom of the house, doing just start with the bathrooms, a bit of dusting, a bit of hoovering, putting any clothes away that might be up there. Um, and yeah, get that done before I start on any big project stuff. It's really wet and dingy out there, which means everything's really dark and disgusting. Um, but let me show you what I've done so far. It is, oh, let me see, 12.12. 12. So I've just tidied a few things away in Ozzy's room, put all the clothes away. I think I need to change Harry's bedding this week. Um, but I've tidied that up, put his clothes away. He's got his hunting gear there when he, he had, um, they had a pheasant shoot this weekend. So he's got that stuff there because I don't know where that goes. Dusted all of his units. Hello, do not wee in here, please, or do anything disgusting. Um, I need to hoover all of this. Um and scrub the bathroom oh, streaks on the mirror i did do the mirror i'll just wipe those bleached all of this i haven't actually done the screen door i best quickly do that while i remember um, bleached all of that there we go i've cleaned that and i wiped the streak oh it's still a streak well it's good enough and rob's just come in and i think that is the prime opportunity for a tea break He's made me a cuppa and got me a Kit Kat. I've been feeling rather fatigued over the last few days. I think it's a change in weather and season. Um, this is white willow bark. So my sister got me this. Um, it's very good for your muscles and rheumatism and sciatica and all that jazz. It says one teaspoon. I just kind of... About that. It's not too bad to taste actually. I mean it Tastes like a willow, like if you were to chew on a willow leaf, I guess. And then this is supposed to be cola flavoured CBD oil. And it is cola flavoured, like really cheap cola flavoured. And I haven't taken this for ages either, so I think that's part of the problem. I'm going to do that a few times a day. But a little bit now and then when I remember is probably better than not at all. So I'll try and get back on to doing that regularly. Anyway, tea break over. I'm going to start downstairs dusting, cleaning, do the bathroom, um, wipe sides down, tidy up. And then I'm going to start the top of the house with a hoover, work my way down. And then if I have time, mop the floors um, before the school run. Um, and then at least I know the house has had a good clean this week. Downstairs bathroom done. Time to mop. Um, probably about one ish now. I'm just dealing with a part of the house that tends to get a bit neglected. It's behind Ozzy's seat. It tends to end up in a bit of a dumping ground and where things get spilt because Ozzy's here. Um, so I've pulled everything out. I've actually mopped that wall with disinfectant and the skirting board a little bit and working my way up under there as well where the chairs usually are, I'm giving it a proper scrub. We have a whole bunch of stuff. All of this stuff. What could we be doing? You will find out one day. So we have some work to do because we have some bulgy roof going on and a leak. So we need to get this dealt with before our project takes off, which we will share with you at some point. There is a project happening. Um, that's going to be there. You right there, Emma? Yeah. And this is the best of the bunch, isn't it? The best of the bunch. I mean, these are really old. Really old stables. Really old stables. So it's going to be another lovely posture, I think, as a temporary... Since we're good at bodge jobs, so... Yeah, exactly. We'll be fine. Well, yeah. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> this is Rob's new toy. It arrived last night. Promptly came off the thing and broke, didn't it? Off the truck and they broke something, a sensor, was oh, you it? Oh, know more than I do. Oh, honest. yeah, they broke a sensor, which is why I was late home for trick-or-treating. Oh, well, he may well have told me, but I was in my angry mindset. At that stage, <laughs> so I wasn't really listening. <laughs> this is his, he was very, he says, come down and have a look at it later, Pip, but I don't think I'm going to have time to actually come and have a proper look at it. But look at the size. Can you see how wide it is? Goodness. He's having a spray. He so said it was a good job he didn't spray. He wanted to play with it last night, but he said it was a good job he didn't because with the rain we had last night, it all just washed off the crop. So that would fit like four or five times over, like just that in the field, the whole. Well, yeah. So where his tram lines are, it comes out all the way to halfway 
between each tram line, doesn't it? So I guess that damages less of the crop. Yeah, so he can he can just ride up and down the tram lines, and it reaches halfway across each time. So it's only getting sprayed once. He's not doubling up on anything. You definitely know more than I do, or you pay more attention than I do. I, think. <laughs> I, I zone out. I've not had to live with it for years. Yeah. Yeah. Still can't tell what crops are cro- what crops what. I've finally worked out what black grass is though. Yeah, that's that horrible it stuff. Grows in my flower beds. <laughs> oh, does it? <laughs> He's not come along and sprayed it yet. No. Well, no, he'd kill everything, wouldn't he? Mm. That's evil. Ch-ch-ch. Yeah. But. I find it very therapeutic picking it out, in all fairness. I think it feels too big. Maybe he should get you to come and sit in the field and pick it out bit by bit, won't you say? Based on how I've been this weekend, I'm not sure that would help my ADHD mindset, in all fairness. Do you not? <laughs> With a high fix... No, you Well, you could be, be hyper-fixed on sorting out his... I know, but I wouldn't be able to stop. That's the thing, and the field's a big space. It is pretty big. But wouldn't it be nice to just sit in the field and just... Yeah, well, if you ever see me... Sitting well, in the field? Spot, yeah, rocking, thinking. <laughs> you know why. Just having a moment. Did having you ever find the scissors I left in this field? No. No. There. Somewhere along that fence line. Where probably ploughed in or in a bale, yeah. Someone gets free scissors with their bale. I was too excited to get on the combine. I forgot about the scissors. <laughs> uh, under those circumstances, we'll let you off. Thank you. Normally I find them in this guy's bedroom, so... Oh, that does look fun. I just find the whole concept of sitting in front like that. Oh, over the wheels that far in front just yeah it's a little bit unnerving isn't it yeah. it's like in a little greenhouse at the front isn't he yeah because he's not even like he's not he's clearly not driving it because all I can see is the back <laughs> I was going to say isn't, didn't I just see the back of him mm. unless he stood up driving it and it's oh I don't know is it no, no there's, there's two people <laughs> there's two people it's not just magic driving oh well, there's three people oh, boy, that man driving is there three people in there yeah how many people can you get in a sprayer? They all wanted a ride, that's what it was. Yeah, yeah, they are. They're all big they? kids, aren't they? Yeah. Can I have a go in your tractor? Actually, that's me, that is. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, that's something we still need to do, to be fair. Teach me to drive a tractor. Yeah, get you in the tractor. Mm-hmm. Don't know how we haven't, well, we just haven't had time to fit it in, have no, we? No, we haven't. We've had other things. No. Lots of things. Look at that hat, it's a bit like Where's Wally, isn't it? I didn't say that, you said that. <laughs> Because it is, it's red and black striped, isn't it, Where's Wally? Yeah, that's green, though. Isn't there one of those in the books? Uh, yeah, there's Waldo, isn't there? The bad one or something, um. yeah. <laughs> oh, Bless no. Bless him. Bless him, yeah. Bless him. It's a can of Red Bull. <laughs> it's go go juice. When you pull in, when you come up to it, can you just stop at the first, us, two, <laughs> first two sheds, please? Um, I think he's expensive. And then I'm going to just chuck it after <laughs> the got in like it's a limo. We go around the other yard and I'll I think we're going up to the thing. I think we're going to the stables. I think. Do well. Thank you very much. We're mind feeders. See you in a bit. Bye bye. All right, boss. Yeah. Where are we going? New spray day. It's nice. Good, isn't it? Filmed your toy. Did you? How many people can you get in a sprayer? Oh, uh, it was tight. <laughs> <laughs> we I thought have... you were driving it, but all we could see was a bum, and we mm. were like, how's he doing that? That's Billy's toy, that is. That's not my toy. It's not though. your own. And we decided you look like, or I've decided you look like, where's Wally? Where's Wally? Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> Hold out there. <laughs> He's doing the weightlifting. Heavy? <laughs> oh. oh. It's all in my boobs. Got that on camera, I think. I don't think they understand what you're saying.
no. Don't stroke me. This is disgusting. I just had to empty all of the cow food out of my clothes. It's making me rather itchy. Um, but they seem happy. Uh, Kenzie's doing the birds for me. I said I'd pay him a bit of money if he did the birds for me. Um, I'm going to start on these dishes. He's outsourcing. You get paid to do a job and then you outsource. You see, it's very clever stuff. Um, yes, and Ozzy's had a fantastic day at preschool. Um, he's only had one accident. And other than that, he's been amazing. So really, really proud of that boy. And what else? Can't remember. Oh, we're not having haircuts. That was the other thing I meant to tell you. Not having haircuts till tomorrow because my friend has a, my hairdresser friend has to take her dog to the vets. So we're going to do hairdressers hairdressing tomorrow. So it looks scraggy for another day. I didn't time that very well. Did it rain on you, Emma? Yeah. Did you get very wet? Yeah. Um, I was actually not concerned about my hair running. <laughs> <laughs> How soggy are your trousers? Yeah, pretty oh, soggy. Are... No, yeah. they. Oh, thanks, Oz. They do look like rising damps going on there. I know. I, uh, it's getting chilly now as well. <laughs> you do look well togged. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Not ideal. You've been. Okay, I can't say what I'm actually doing. No. <laughs> yeah. Because they're being bummed. Yes. <laughs> yeah. No. Yes, but yes, I am. Yes. Why have we got our feet out, Ozzy? Got your feet. Why have we got to have our feet out? What are we doing? I've got no big feet. My big feet. I've got two big feet. You've got a big toe. Where's my big toe? Yeah. That's right. Got your feet, little feet. My little toe, that's right. Yeah. Right, who's going to put their foot on it? Pippa put a foot on it? No, I didn't. Okay, Ozzy, do it then. Stomp, stomp, stomp. Stomp, stomp, stomp. Um, that's your heel. Your ten. Ready, my toes. Oh, the heel. Yeah. The heel of the foot. There we are. Your heel and my heel. What about the toes? My head. Your head. Go on then. Ooh. Let's see. Your head. Oh, I'm not putting my head on it. Your head. Your head. Right. <laughs> 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 Thanks, Ozzy. <laughs> Apparently, I'm putting my head on the Play-Doh. No. This is a non Xmas special offer. So we're we're going for the the early Christmas booking, aren't we? What so what is happening here? This place is selling turkeys. So this is basically in a minute, Oz. One of the local butchers. Ozzy, I'm just doing something um, to where we live, and they supply a lot of very local products, and they okay. seem to have a selection of turkeys that they've got already, which they are boning and rolling for sale for people's point prices. Because so, of the whole potential turkey crisis with bird yeah, flu? potentially. Or maybe it could be these, could be just earlier birds maybe. I don't recall them maybe doing it before, so I don't know, but I think maybe we would be sensible to... Um, get in early, do it now, yeah, shall we? Yeah, we've got some food space, so we may as well Let's do that. It, and then we'll cover it if nothing else, and then yeah. we'll do the rest of the other bits, but first to the time. That's a good idea, let's do uh, that. It's, um, so I've, I've got everybody, so I'm going to have to get a 5k one. Okay. Um, so that is... It, it isn't cheap. That's going to be just shy of eight pounds. Yeah. Um, yes. You can do, but at the moment I'm just dealing with something with mummy. One more. One more. One more. The child and the bird are simultaneous with the noise that they're producing. We're not done. You've not given me two seconds to achieve it. One more. One more second. This is every night, oh. isn't it, in this house? Just. <laughs> Feel frazzled? <laughs> noise. It's noise. In a minute, Pip's just picking a turkey and then she'll be with you, okay? Picking a turkey, all right? Because I just need to pay for it. I'm now home. Me and my lovely man are about to have chilli con carne, which I put in the slow cooker earlier on. Chilli chilli. Chilli Kenzie's had his. And uh, this is quite a large meal, I have to say. <laughs> 